Well, that was a great honor to have such a hero in the house today as Vindman, huh? Yeah. One of the top whistleblowers of all time. That was incredible courage. Where'd you get those shoes? Hmm? Ah. Uh, in the, my garage, they were in a box. Oh. I think it belonged to a great uncle from, uh, you know, the old country. You know, my bubby, my grandfather, Yitzhak Maltsevich. He wore similar shoes, you know? Oh, yeah? I have a oh. photograph of him before the war. I'll tell you. Yeah. Well, we had a hero in the house today. If I could just do something as brave in my political career. Let me tell you something, sister, OK? You're doing something more heroic. You're repealing that five-foot fence law. Vindman's going to be looking up to you one day. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Saying, I wish I could be more like Irma Kostrowski. She took on big fence. Yeah. Well, we got the vote, so we shall see. You'll be able to run on that. I got news for you. When's the last time you had the passport? I don't fucking know, Larry. You're not big at the airport three hours early for fucking international flights and shit. I got a fucking few hours left, man. I need my damn passport. Hey, city council's voting tonight to repeal. It's tonight already? It's tonight, yeah. Oh, my God. Where the fuck's the passport? Even if they vote to repeal it, it's all going to be meaningless if Weinblatt reads that Vindman transcript. Are uh, you sure Weinblatt hasn't read it already? No, because it couldn't have come until today, and Irma told me that he's been at the council all day. So what are you going to do? Leave those in there. I know he lives with his mother, and I'm going to talk my way in and Damn it. hopefully find the transcript. Oh, God. Can't find the passport. You know what? I had to get a license to get a passport. You know what I'm saying? I use my real full name, too. What, what's your full name? Leon Luscious Black. Your middle name is Luscious? It's Lucius, but I pronounce it Luscious. Everybody calls me Luscious. Oh. You need some help? Fuck yeah, my flight's in a few hours, Larry. I need help. I can't get on the fucking plane with no goddamn passport. I feel like I'm doing my part by allowing him to be in my house. Sweetheart, what can I do for you? Head Councilman Weinblatt would be very interested in this. Oh, but, but he's not here. All right, I'll give it to him when he comes home. Gotta be here somewhere. Any luck? No. Have you seen it? If I saw it, we wouldn't be here right now. Yeah. I mean, we gotta be there. This is international. Maybe it's home. Maybe you're right. It's gotta be home. There you go. I think it is. Okay, look, we're gonna go home. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna get my passport, and you go to the airport right now. Hold the gate up. Okay. Once they close that fucking door, that's it. Okay. I can't get on. I'll meet you there. Before you get to the gate, grab me one of those neck pillows. Okay. And two Slim Jims. They don't have them over there. Okay. Well, I will be the last person to board, okay? Hold the gate. I'm gonna hold the gate. All right, boo. Meet you there. I'll be there. Simon, is it possible we could end the meeting a little earlier tonight? We have a lot to cover, but I will try to rush it. Hi, Danielle. Hi, Hi Simon. How are you? How are you? Oh, hi. Oh. This is Weinblatt. I'm here to see Simon. Yes. Um, for Torah study? Torah lesson with we're studying, my son. We're studying Torah. Well, he's not here right now. He's still at work. Huh. Oh. Well, that's odd. We made plans. He must be running late, I guess. Oh, look, it's cold. Come on in. Yeah, thank you. Oh, the dog gets stuck. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome, sweetheart. 